Hey my Cadex peeps, it's Tony with Alameda Ulcers. Guys, I had a question, one of my subscribers, how much is it going to cost me to make a holster? And guys, that's a good question because you're not going to make a holster for 20 bucks unless you buy a shell or something like that. So if you're going to make a holster and you're going to start doing this, it's going to cost you some money. And I kind of want to do a walkthrough so you guys kind of maybe get a better feel for what I'm talking about. Okay, computer, you're going to need, well first, you're going to need a place to put it. So I have it in my freaking little shed workshop and I have this insured for 20 grand. And I thought it was outrageous, but you start kind of adding little things here and there and the price starts going up. So, you know, you're going to need a computer if you're going to do a website. So, there's money there. You're going to need of course electricity, you know, how you're going to heat it, how you're going to cool it. You're going to need tooling. So, you're going to need mold guns. Right? You need mold guns. Um uh, you're going to need a heat source and, you know, you start adding the computer, all the little stuff that's just laying right there, the little press, some mags, the strip heater, you start adding the ovens, you start adding the pumps, and that's not even what is, you know, in here you've got Foamies, loops, you name it, it's in there. You got your vacuum former. Are you going to do it yourself or are you going to buy one? If you're going to buy one, there's money there. Drill press, are you going to go the drill press route or the handheld route? You're going to sit, you need a chair. Um, you're going to clean up, you need a vacuum. You're going to do coffee bomb, you need that press. You need a place to wash your stuff. You're gonna need a compressor, drills, more tools. I think there's, heck, I don't even know how much is in here. Got three Dremels, safety stuff. Got the uh, buffers, got the scroll saw. Then get into the hardware bunch of hardware right there so plus then you get into need some bands for the wallets need some shock cord prints so to answer that question I don't know what you're willing to spend just sit down before you even start this and lay out what you're going to do, what your goal is. Uh, my older video, the end game, what's your end game? What do you want? Because right now I'm gonna, I need to get a heat press. I've had a heat press two and a half years ago. It wasn't for me because my wiring wasn't up to standards. So I kept blowing circuits and you end up hating it. Yada, yada, yada. So now I've got a heat press coming. So you know, there's more money, more money the first of the year getting dumped in. And, um, you know, it's true, it takes money to make money, but just figure out, guys, what you want. You're not gonna go get into this for 50 bucks. There is no way. It's gonna cost you 50 bucks just for material. So, think about that. Good luck with your projects, guys. Don't burn yourself. Not to be a negative Nancy, we'll just leave it with Tactical girl Katrina. Peace guys, don't burn yourself.